All right, there's the Ursaluna. Now show your medal to Ursaluna. But remember that Ursaluna is a Pokemon very dear to the Pro Clan. I will not prevent you to catch him. Okay, great. So we're just battling. Cool, cool, cool. I know Ursaluna is ground. So starting with Duat's a good choice, but what level is it going to be? I'm guessing 30? 26, perfect. Oh, perfect. All right, so last time we left off, um, we were just training up a bit. We, of course, defeated the totem Pokemon. We made it to a new area over here, uh, the Crimson Marlins, which is like this whole area here. Off screen, I said I was going to train a bit, so I made it all the way to Bogbound Camp. And then right now, I kind of went north on complete accident, like this way. I was looking for a Togepi, but I didn't know how far I would go. And there's like level 50, 55, 40 Pokemon over here. I'm getting kind of destroyed low key. Um, so yeah, I'm going to make my way back down here, but I want to stop over here really quick. Actually, look, all my Pokemon are like pretty much defeated, dude. I was getting destroyed. Um... I caught some Rhyhorn too. That was pretty cool. There's a bunch of water Pokemon and sky Pokemon I saw, but I can't reach them at all. Because you can't swim. You kind of like drowned. And I ran across this diamond settlement on complete accident. Which I don't know if I should do anything about that. Let me let me actually just fly back here first. Or, wait, hold on. Nah, let me fly here first. Actually, oh, is it here? Yeah, it's here, it's here. Let me fly back here. Let me just talk to him. Yeah, I could use a rest. Uh, morning. Yep. Alright, there we go. All my Pokemon are healed. Cool, cool, cool. Yeah, what do, you, what do you got, man? <laughs> Alright, usual nonsense. Yeah, I got like... Eight, nine. Nine, so I have 30. One of these. Oh, uh, actually, no, okay. Alright, cool, cool, cool. Let me quickly talk to the professor, see what he has to say. Yeah, report my findings. Oh, I caught a wish cash too. Because he was right by the bank, so I was like, eh, might as well. And I got some money back. Also, yeah, I just got my third star. I think I did that off screen. Nah, I'm gonna keep going. Yeah. Alright, let me go here. Missions. There we go. And the problem with this area was the was the Ursa Luna, so we're gonna see what that's about. Here's the lady we helped last time, Kalava. Had to re had to retrieve a what's it called a ruin fragment that got broken uh, from this team that stole it, a uh, bandit squad that stole it. All right, there's the Ursaluna. Now show your medal to Ursaluna. But remember that Ursaluna is a Pokemon very dear to the Pro Clan. I will not prevent you to catch him. Okay, great. So we're just battling. Cool, cool, cool. I know Ursaluna is ground. So starting with Duat's a good choice, but what level is it gonna be? I'm guessing 30? 26, perfect. Oh, perfect. Also, I faced an Onyx. I was like level 50. And. Um, Onyx, I was level 50. And it knew like every move in the book for some reason. So I was getting destroyed over there. But I did defeat it though, so I guess that helped. Okay, go twice. Whatever. Uh, water Pulse. 
slash. Yeah, that's fine. And so far, this Krogunk that I have is like one of the most useful Pokemon I've gotten so far. Normal and ground, that's what it was. Super effective, gotta probably kill me. Yeah. Alright, so this is like a fair, kind of a fair battle. Air Slash. Ooh, perfect. Alright, no one leveled up though. I'm still waiting for Duat to get to like 30. It'll clear out any poisonous, any poison in a Pokemon's body if poisons what Ursula's rage is. Toxagon? Interesting. Or it'll probably make it worse. Nah. Did it work? It's so potent that we can only use it on tough, resilient Pokemon like Ursulina. He really wasn't... He wasn't really frenzied, yeah. That girl from the <clears throat> that girl from the Diamond Clan, Arizu. Now, why did she, why did she of all people find the need to come and tell me about Ursula? I wonder. And we we also passed a thing camp, a uh, Diamond Camp just now. Wait, so, so does that mean we have Ursuluna as one of the things we could call on, or no? Dig for treasure. Uh, does that help at all? Oh, it's like the... Uh, Like the dowsing machine? That's how it's going to go. Alright, let me see something. Old verse 9. Uh, maybe later? Um, that didn't that didn't seem what, what I was trying to get to, but alright. Like, that was kind of weird. Oh. Come in there, come on. So what I'm guessing is, we're gonna go report it to Commander Kamado, right? And then, no, I didn't really do much. Yeah. Now we're gonna report to Commander Kamado and then we're gonna have to investigate that diamond camp that we just saw up north. Diamond clan camp up north. <clears throat> Okay, here's Akari. Uh, there you are. You better hurry into the commander's office. Okay. Seems like some type of emergency, kind of. And here's these people. Still don't know what clan they're from or what they got going on. They're just selling stuff, I know that, but... They just seem a bit out of place. Alright, all the way up to the top.
Here's a store guy and then the Diamond Clan leader. Lilligant, our clan's Lady of the Ridge, is in a frenzy. And Arizu knowingly kept this from me. Arizu. A Lilligant. Oh, let me talk about that. Yes, they're only, they're only female Lilligant, which makes this honored. Okay, alright. I'd like to find out uh, just what Arizu was thinking, but she's nowhere in Jubilee Village. Okay. <laughs> was somehow involved in that situation with the Raging Arceluna of the Pearl Clan. It could lead to the two clans going, yeah, getting into a fight. Trying to keep the peace. Alright, we get it, man. Perhaps you have uh, some idea how we might address the situation. Okay, see, now Ursula is making sense. Crimson Marlin, all right, cool, cool, cool. Okay, we're going back to the Crimson Marlin to find Arizu, because apparently she just disappeared. Uh, that girl who said out earlier must have been eating some of Benny's potato mochi. Ursula now now knows Arizu sent. Followed the blue signals to find her. All right, cool, cool, cool. Tracking down Arizu. Nope. Okay, around the lake for sure. I will say Ursaluna is kind of fast. Okay, across the lake again. Right there, this way. Yeah, I'm surprised it climbed up that like that. That was pretty cool. Oh, what that shit, bro? Alright, so we found a Rizu. Here we go. Oh, King. Uh, how did it all go with Ursula? He tracked me all the way here by the sense of these potato mochi I ate. Yep. I got chased by a Pokemon and sprained my ankle pretty bad as I was running away. I treated you with disrespect, thinking you were just some whelp from the Diamond Clan. I'm sorry for that. Okay, patching up relations. Alright. It's not your fault that Lilligant became frenzied, nor that my Ursuluna was so enraged. You were trying to help them both, weren't you? I didn't even have the courtesy to listen to you. You'd think someone who's lived as long as I have would be more patient. <laughs> Close to Lilligant smelled her perfume. Okay, the Lilligant's perfume made Ursuluna mad. Alright.
See, the reason I went up, I went to Dublife was to get help first, Luna, and also learn about crafting. Cleaver. Uh -huh. Well then, we better take care of Our Lady and get all this mess resolved first. That tree's bugging out in the background. Listen up, King. I'll take the bombs that Arizu made and meet you at Bravo Arena. <clears throat> okay, so I'm guessing Lilligan is gonna be even stronger than Ursaluna, so we're gonna have to uh, we're gonna have to train up a bit. Uh, my dear Babero and I will make sure she reaches our her lady. All right, cool. All right, this tree's like annoying me now. <clears throat> Wasn't trying to kill it, but all right. Okay, so now I'm guessing they're all the way up at the diamond camp. So what I'm going to do is... First off, you see this rock right here? Hold up. See, there has to be a type of Pokemon that can destroy this thing right here. Oh, maybe Lil again. Hold up. Maybe maybe that's what it is. Yeah, let me go this way. To the Diamond Settlement over here. <clears throat> We're going to do a lot of training over here for sure. But let me talk to this lady right here. Oh, headaches for the side duck. That's still a thing even back now. Come on, man. Y'all remember how they used to block um, that one pathway to Lacey on Town, I think? I will say they do have pretty cool uniforms. <clears throat> I'm looking at the map, right? So, the Diamond Clan's here. So I'm guessing the Pearl Clan is either here on the bottom or somewhere up to the north. Wait, actually. Oh, so you can find... Hold on. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Oh, man. Okay, so there's definitely is Ursaluna here somewhere. Oh, also, let me do this. Let me just try to catch this or at least battle it. See look 45, you see what I'm talking about? That's why I said Lilligan is probably high 30s. Look at that one shot on D1. Who has the type of advantage and everything like that? See, can I get one? Maybe.
And I know that uh, Hisuian Lilligant is like still grass, but maybe grass fighting? Maybe. I know it's kind of purple. Dang. This phrase all the stats, like, that's not even fair. I wonder if catch rate still uh, applies to this game as well. Like, the more you throw Pokeballs, the higher chance you have. Alright, still enraged. <coughs> Super effective, that's a one shot. I'm gonna try to start Evia, see if I can catch it. If not, I'm just gonna just defeat it. Alright, Kogo, time to finish this completely. Like I said, Kogo comes in clutch when you Quickly do. First off, there's a whole thing up there. I haven't gone this way. This looks like a lake with something special in the middle over there. But, uh, Combi. Anything else? More combi. Graveler. Onyx. Hey, there's a lot of land this way, man. Vespa Queen, okay. Alright, hold on, let me let me actually go back here really quick. Let me just heal up. Alright. <clears throat> let me start packing some stuff away here. Eleven tumble stones. All 
Alright. Well. Let me head back to this diamond settlement right here. I should make my way north a bit to see what it looks like. Definitely do I definitely need Duat to get a little stronger. Like that. I need him to master water pulse. I feel like I've been using the same type of water pulse forever. I have to do better use of my inventory. So here's fire, which means going up this way. Ooh, wait a second. Let me do this. I've been waiting for one of these. Okay, or not. There's a rosary too, okay. Oh, I'm using the wrong thing, I'm supposed to uh, I don't have any heavy balls anyway, so. Okay, looks like I'm just gonna go off the rosary. Hopefully it doesn't kill me. Let me quickly do this though. Let me read something. Okay, great balls. Feather balls. Oh, okay, never mind. It's spinning around. Whoa, 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 bro. Fifty. Come on, man. No, that's who I needed to win this battle. That's good. Cool. That's one thing I do hate. They always go first. It's kind of annoying. Go back. Poison jab? Shadow Ball. Oh. That, that'll do it for sure. Especially strong style? Yeah. damage man I know what I could do. Let me let me cheat really quick. There you go. And that, ladies and gentlemen, is how you cheat the system. So that you don't just lose. And that's also why you stock up on uh, revives as well. Thank you. Thank you. 
Everybody's around the same health level, except for Krogonk. And see, it'll still keep it at low. But it, it might still attack first, though. Yeah. That's fine. It's not gonna bring in Staravia to actually do what I came here for. Hopefully, don't kill it, though. Gust, my weakest flying type move. Strong style should be enough. There we go. Perfect, perfect, perfect. Poison dab. Yep, that's fine, that's fine, that's fine. Krogunk. I mean, Golbat, my bad. And then what I'm gonna do is, now that I crafted Great Balls, perfect. This should work out fine. Hold on. Great Ball. Which is better than the regular one. A Pokeball. Okay, fine. Take one. Shadow Ball. Yep. That's weird. It's kind of like the Pokemon knows what'll work and what won't work. Very strange. Very strange. I wonder where you get when, when you get Ultra Balls. Is it tier four? I mean, star level four. Enrage, boost everything as usual. <clears throat> Super effective. That's one thing I do hate about the Pokeballs in this game. There's no indication if you're close or not. Dude, you just gotta hang on. Like, once. And his offense keeps getting raised, so it's not like I can survive an attack anyways. Yeah, see? Oh, wait a second. Uh, let me do this. Craft. Like, I'm gonna catch this Rose Raid. Like, I'm not really gonna leave until I do. So I'll probably speed up this whole part to see if it even catches. And there's no point in you wasting my potions because they don't even last. Long. Wait, 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 wait. Bro, no way you just turned that. Bro, no way. Okay. All right, we're battling Honchko now, I, I, I guess. He's gonna go first. Yeah, Braver. Thing uh, about half paralysis, maybe no nasty plot. All right, dark pulse back to back. Right. I'm gonna do what in really quick. Bird should take it down to red. Wait, I get hit by that attack too. That's kind of weird. Recoil, red. Okay. Right, Sylveon, you're gonna go in. Let me try a great ball. See if that does anything for me. Or just don't let me go at all. 
Uh, I took a health down more, so that's fine. Okay, is it gonna be my turn or it's still its turn? Okay, you throw a great ball now, please. All right, I guess Hunchcore will take that. Okay, well, I know Growing Up Bear is going to be where the Lilligith is. Definitely going to go on Alpha Member of the Species. All right, definitely going to train up some more, and then, and then we'll be back to do a uh, Lilligus, like, uh, Noble Pokemon trial or whatever. So make sure you guys like and subscribe. I'll catch you guys next time, man. Thank you guys for watching.